Hi, brothers and sisters. My name is Nick Newey, and it's been a while, hasn't it? Now, um, I do want to point out that if you want in the Hall of Shoutouts, uh, from now on, you're going to have to ask, uh, because I used to just do it, uh, just whenever somebody subscribed, but thing is, I don't really know... The thing is, sometimes... It, like, I do get a notification when somebody subscribes to me. But, like... I don't always get back to Minecraft before I have time to put their thing on. So... Like, if you... If you wanna... If you wanna shout out from now on... Yeah, you're gonna have to ask. And when the series is over, I can't really give shout outs in there anymore. Um... Now, some of you might be wondering why I haven't recorded in a while. And the answer is, there's a bunch of reasons. Um, I think the first and foremost is that hunting enderpearls is kind of boring. Um, and that's kind of what I'm doing right now. That's pretty much all I'm doing is just hunting enderpearls in this game. And it's kind of boring, so I don't want to record it. And since it's so boring... I don't really feel like doing it anyway, so it's not like I do it very much. Um, so I've kind of been doing it off camera. And I have I have gone through a set of armor. As you can see, I have some new armor on right now. Because I've already gone through a set of armor. Uh, uh, this one's still my old chest plate, I'm pretty sure. Ah. Uh, but I do have a replacement for when that breaks. Uh, to be honest, it's hard to hunt Endermen back in these days. I mean, the world wasn't so big, so it's not like you could just find an open area like a desert where they could spawn. I think the reason the desert is the best place to hunt for Endermen is because it doesn't rain there. And so, like, Endermen don't, like, get mad. I have heard somewhere that they spawn more on sand, but I'm not sure about that at all. Alright, we can just throw some random stuff that we have in here. Yeah, and like the thing is, we will need arrows before we go and face the Ender Dragon as well, which is not something I've been um, getting, but like that is something we definitely need. Yeah, I'm just going to go out there with, like, very few health points, very few hunger points. We'll just see what happens. Yeah. I don't even have, like, a, a great source of food. I have that wheat farm, but it's not very big. Like, when I play on computer, I usually get, like, stacks of food. Like, on this one server I'm playing on, I've got, like, 64 steaks. And it's just, like... Watching this series, that is unbelievable. How would I get 64 stakes? I don't know. I don't even know. But today, we're playing Xbox. And I feel like if I knew how to update this game, uh, the series might be better. Because, like, with the new... I, I like the newer stuff. Like, I know a lot of people just like this version of Minecraft, and that's it. It's like, classic... Classic old days of Minecraft. And that's about it, but... For me, I like the newer stuff. The, well, I can't play 1.14 because I need to upgrade my graphics card. And I don't know how to do that. And it's not like yeah, I'm even using my own computer. I'm using my grandma's computer. I mean, it has been a couple years since they've released OpenGL 2.0, but, like, I don't have it. And what I don't like is that it's, like, required. Like, I wish that was, like, an optional thing. That you could just choose your graphics to be that if you so please. But maybe I do just need to get with the times and learn when to upgrade my graphics stuff. I think that is a problem a bunch of gamers have, is that, like, they don't want to update their graphics cards and such, and then, like, sometimes, sometimes, like, newer games require that stuff. So, like, 
the the latest I could play on computer from now on is 1.13 until I get a new graphics card, but I don't know how to do that. Because I remember trying to update it once, and then like it just completely broke our computer and we had to get a new one. Because it was an old computer that couldn't handle new graphics. <laughs> I love how I'm telling you guys this stuff and you probably don't even know what I'm talking about. What is the graphics card? What is OpenGL 2.0? I'm gonna pick a flower. I'm gonna pick a flower. Uh. Do you guys watch Petscop? Like, there's this series out there called Petscop, and it's like a, it's a really, it's a spooky internet series. Um, and it's been theorized so much. And I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, and recently, like on Easter Day, I believe it was, uh, now you see, the channel doesn't upload videos often. It usually just uploads, like, one video every th few months. But, like, on Easter, on Easter Sunday, they released, like, one, two, three, four, five. They released five episodes. Well, I think they released one on Easter Eve and then four on Easter. Um, and so, like, the fan base just went wild because, like, there's just, like, five new videos. So the fan base has been enjoying themselves. Myself included. There's been a bunch of new memes. I would recommend Pets Cup. Uh. Uh. Diddly, diddly. This is kind of weird, though. Uh, wait, what? There's stuff over here? What? I didn't even realize there was stuff over here. Hang on, wait a second. You guys don't know how, how like, exciting this is to me. Because for me, like, I didn't know there was anything out this direction. Like, I've been farming Enderman in that one spot for, like, a couple days now. And I just didn't even realize this was over here. What? There's an entirely new section of land to explore that we haven't seen in the series yet. There's a big old tree over there. There's a, there's a, oh, there's a bit of desert, I think, over there. Oh, desert is a great place to hunt Enderman. Or so I hear. But the sun is going down, so we better get over to that desert fast. And uh, build ourselves a little Enderman hunting spot. Yeah, let's get over to the desert. I can't run. I mean, if I ate, I could run. But I don't want to eat now, do I? I could, like, I could, like, move a bed over here and just make a, uh, establish a base out here. Yeah, I could do that. Yeah. So what you want to do with Enderman is you want to, like... What I like to do is I like to build a little structure. I don't have enough dirt to make a structure. I don't have enough dirt to make a, a full-fledged Enderman structure. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's okay. I can cut corners. I can cut corners. I can literally cut corners. I can literally cut corners. Yeah, and then we get uh, that... And that needs to extend out a bit. Extend out a little bit. Okay. And then we'll just like pick up a random bit of sand and do 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 do. There we go. Actually, maybe it shouldn't be that close to the shelter. That, that bit of sand's levitating. Uh, that bit of sand is uh, defining the laws of uh, what we would call physics. <laughs> that's, that's defining the laws of what we would call physics. Uh, I'm gonna get uh, physics police up on 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 that. All right. So now we just wait. 
We wait for the men of Ender. The Endermen. <gasps> I didn't know they were in this version! Villages! I mean, they, uh, it's kind of obvious that they would be in this version. But, like, uh, they're villages. And that creeper's running over to me to try to kill me. And he's probably gonna. Yep. <laughs> yep. I mean... Yep. <laughs> yep. Okay. I feel like when the night ends, that's when this episode's gonna end. Ow. Ow. Let me get through. I'm trying to get back to the desert so I can get my stuff before it despawns. Uh, but now that we have a desert... Oh, cool. I do reckon that I need to, like, make a little house out there. Out at that, uh, desert. That's interesting. I did not realize the world extended that far. Oh, I can't... Oh. Yeah, in 1.13, you can run in water. You can, like, caturl. Caturl? You could caturl in water. And, uh, it's fun. Alright. When the night ends, I think, is when I'll end this episode. Because I want to find Iron Man. But now that we found a desert... It will probably be easier for me to fa farm Enderman. I mean, I know you guys haven't seen all my Enderman farming episodes. I kind of, like... Actually, we could just take refuge in the village. And that could be our house. Yeah. We'll need some wool, though. So we should probably find some sheep. There's some sheep up there. I feel like I should make shears instead of just killing them like I normally do. Um, all right, well, we got to be quick, so run, because, like, the thing is, I thought this up here was the edge of the world because of how blocky it was, but no, it's just the ice extends out quite a bit. I did not even realize that there was more, there was more stuff out here. There's, like, so much more stuff out here. I also find it interesting how that desert is right next to a snow biome. I find that really interesting. That is quite, quite interesting. Ow. All right. And then we go over this direction. We have to find that creeper crater. The creeper crater. We have to find a creeper crater. I know where it was. I could go over to the village. I feel like the village will be a place of refuge for me in these future future months. Uh oh. Don't let that creeper blow up my stuff. Because if they blow up your stuff, they blow up your stuff. Alright. Oh! Oh, the sun's already rising. Oh, man. I didn't even find a single Enderman. Well, that's okay. Because look at this. Look at this miles and miles of dirt. Not even dirt. That's sand. So... That will be interesting. Uh, but for now, I think I'll take refuge in the village. <gasps> Wait! Food! Food! Stuff to make food! Oh. Stuff to make food. Stuff to make food. Stuff to make food. Stuff to make food with. Ah. Uh. Uh, okay, well, this is probably where I'm going to take refuge for uh, the next couple of episodes. Because, uh... I... Uh... 
Uh, not that house. Those houses have mob spawn in them. Because, uh, you know, if an Enderman shows up, we'll just be able to take refuge in one of these houses. And I'll be okay. So. Thank... Okay, I'm going to get an empty hand. Cause th Thanks, everyone, so very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. May God bless you and keep you safe.